Hey everyone, it's Max here from Reptile Fanatics. So today we're gonna to look at the Whistling Tree Frog or Brown Tree Frog, originally from Australia, now naturalized in New Zealand. There's only three exotic species you can keep in captivity, the Golden Bell Frog, the Southern Bell, and the Whistling Tree Frog. Now these guys are super cool. Now known for Whistling Tree Frogs, they do whistle, although you only really hear the males whistle, or some of them whistle in the evenings, late at night. This guy is a juvenile. Now, I've got him in this glass terrarium setup. So this one was a bit of an experiment, a little project for myself, where I wanted to build an aesthetically pleasing, as well as a basically a chunk of wild for this guy. So basically a lot of vegetation, letting it grow over time, even having a little bit of water in the corner where there's duckweed, letting the ecosystem really, really grow and build and develop into a super, super cool enclosure for this guy, trying to mimic the wild environment as much as possible. Now, whistling tree frogs are really, really cool animals. Uh, really cool that we even get to have a tree frog in New Zealand and keep it in captivity. I think that's very fortunate for us, uh, all of us based in New Zealand who love keeping exotic reptiles and amphibians in captivity. So these guys are pretty easy to look after as long as you create the right environment. So you don't have to have an, a complex environment like this. You can have a glass fish tank or even a plastic uh, fish tank or terrarium with very, very little water. They are tree frogs guys, so they are mainly a boreal and terrestrial nature, but you still need some water for them. So what I do with this is, like I said, a little bit of experiment. I missed it every day and it's just turned into this super, super cool aesthetic uh, terrarium that I keep in the kitchen and the lighting's perfect so only gets natural sunlight through the windows so it doesn't overheat and this guy's basically flourishing in here now with diet whistling tree frogs eat small insects so uh, fruit flies even house flies are fine jumping spiders you can do white worms when they're smaller but these guys don't get very big so this guy is probably about two centimeters in length so still fairly small they get to about three to five centimeters in length as adults so a small tree frog species, but look at them, absolutely gorgeous. They are nocturnal, so at night you can see them jumping all over the terrarium, they're hunting, uh, their eyes go pitch black basically, you can barely see the outer brown lining, but gorgeous animals. Anyway guys, I'm Max, I love reptiles, love amphibians, this is the Whistling Tree Frog, if you like what I'm doing, like and subscribe, and stay tuned for the next one.